Your it's your boy girl here back with another video and today today I'm gonna have a special video for you guys today I will be show, show you know doing the battle 51 event for um the final four cooler event um that you know that just came out I know it been out for some time but you know I've just been um just been doing some college you know college work and stuff like that and you know just taking my time off of YouTube and Dragon Ball Legends for a little, for a little bit you know don't want to overwork myself and stuff so uh yeah so about this event you know uh i love these events you know this is a way another way of giving you a thousand cc you know to 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 everyone you know that's always a great thing you know you can use a thousand cc for so many things like summoning you know you can work that on to a zenkai you know zenkai 7 unit excuse me for that um like a zenkai unit of your choice you know cc is just you know it's just you can never complain about getting more CC. Um, so I'm not, I'm not I'm not mad about what they did there. But yeah, we're talking about this event, though. Um, these type of events, you know, you got to come in with a different approach than, like, a regular PvP or stuff like that. Cause, or, like, just a regular AI, like, a regular, say, co-op. Or, like, say, like, you know, like a Legends Road event. Like, because these AIs are pretty much to their best you know it's pretty much like despair difficulty that's what i kind of see it as you know every time you attack this it's a perfect vanish you know they deal intense damage especially this one since they have the bardock the bardock is giving them crit damage too like that's insane like so um i, I see what they try to do there but like they just like it's honestly an instant kill with this so um, my tips for this is when you um when you're building like your team, you know you can beat this with different different teams and stuff like that. Um, when your your bench, like try to have your bench with just this just your straight attack power. Like don't don't try to have a bench where oh the um this guy's gonna get double defense for me because it doesn't really matter. Oh well, you see <laughs> you see like like for example like like that like with the crit buff from Bardock, he just one shot in my golden freezer, but but um. Yeah, like just don't don't go with the defense equipped because all you gonna you're gonna be trying to evade their attack. You're not gonna try to like let them hit you, right? Like PvP, you know, you have you you can take turns, absorb some damage and stuff. So you can add the add people that have defensive abilities, right? But here you got you gotta use the offense, you gotta use just straight up offense. Try to, you know, you know, deal more damage as possible. Don't you don't wanna, you know, keep doing the same things over because you have a better chance of making a mistake right so that's that's my tip for this but um let's see what else do i have oh yeah find your rhythm in these events i said this in my last one then my last one that i did on one of these is to find your rhythm because um that's all that you know ai's are gonna have a certain amount of patterns they do like they have a certain limited amount of patterns that they you know they approach the um they approach you with so if you kind of you know just get that down and don't attack them and let them attack you, you know, because if you're if you attack them, right, you know, they have a better chance of perfect vanishing you. And after you vanish, you know, try to use a blast card. If you have a blast card, use that instead of the strike arts card, because as you see there with my freezer, I, start, I started with the strike. I mean, I picked the blast card over the strike because it just works. I don't know why, like the AI just doesn't know what to do when you dodge and come in with the with the blast card and the strike. like. When I use a strike card, there's a better chance for them to like, there's a better chance for them to dodge. So I just don't know why, you know, that's how my, um, that's how my go to freezer died, you know, I had straight strike cards, but with the, uh, yeah, you see there, like they just died. You like, you see the perfect vanish, like they're, they're not going to, they're always going to perfect vanish every time they dodge. So I always just, you know, go straight with the, uh, with the strike cards. And this match was very, very close. Like you guys can see it. like. I was a little panicking, um, but lucky for here, you know, I was able to get another um, blast card from Frieza. You know, every time you use a blast card, I mean, not a blast, special move card, he gets extra key and stuff after he uses it. So I was able to get another one because he brings another one. So it's a good win on me, you know. Um, and that I didn't complete all the challenges, so um, I will be showcasing the next team like right about now. Right. All right. So next team I have. I brought in a uh, red Vegeta, red uh, GT Vegeta, purple EX Goku, and uh, the blue Namco Fiku, not Namco Fiku, because 
you know, a Fiku, you know, you're going to be switching a lot. So Fiku, if you switch them out four times, it gives them an extra 40% damage to your whole team. And then EX Goku's because to complete one of the challenges, and then I just have to make sure one of my, one of my, um, none of my units die and stuff like that. So, um, so yeah, um, and then Vegeta, right, Vegeta and, and the EX Goku, you know, they get key when they switch in, which that's, you know, that kind of really, really helped me to get my flow in this game, you know, because there's going to be times where, where like, say, like with the LOE, I mean, the LOE team, it was, they actually had people that gave key as well, right? So you really want to target people, you know, if you have units that gets key when they come in, like I highly suggest it because you're not going to, um, you're not going to, you know, run into like this wall. Like there's a time where like, you like where you can't really generate key and you have cars and like you just can't you know you just can't produce damage and you kind of get stuck if you know like people's time accounts pretty low um and you get stuck and that's how you can easily like lose a, a opponent so i highly just you know get units get units that can um that gets key because that key is very like if they switch out they give key or they come in with key you know that's pretty big in these type of events and stuff like that so um you know i'm just showing you guys the gameplay you see me not trying not attack and i'm waiting for broly to attack and going in with the strike card switch vegeta do my little damage and stuff you know prolonging his combo you know just to make sure you know my uh goku could come back just in case for that bardock and stuff and if you know sometimes just because you dodge sometimes you can you can just just tap him out you know if you if you feel like you know when you dodge and they automatically are just right there, just tap them out and reset, you know. You can always do that reset and just try it again, you know, right? You know, because you don't have to attack every time you dodge because of the, if you, you know, if you're just not prepared, then they can, they can get you right there and mess you up. So, you know, you got to pick and choose when you want to attack. You know, try to attack when you have a blast card. It's going gonna, it's gonna to help. Um, and stuff like that. I know I'm just repeating stuff, but that's just how it is. That's how you, that's how you beat these events for the people that's struggling. Um, let's see. So, so you know, like, and then there's times like this, right, where you don't have like the color, you don't have like your color advantage guy yet against, you know, say he has a green. You see how I didn't have EX Goku. So you know, sometimes you have to, you know, freestyle it. You know, you have to, you know, be. You have to. Um, find a way to you know pause and uh and bring the guy back and stuff so you know you know you just kind of have to you know i mean you just have to play it by ear and you know with these events they, you know you have unlimited tries and stuff so and you don't really need to beat it um but to get the thousand cc but it's just kind of like you know i'm a completionist i just want to complete everything and yeah that's really um what i have to say um there's gonna be probably like around two more minutes of gameplay of, and you, I just want you guys to see like how I play and like how I was able to beat this event and you know just kind of like you know just learn from it right so I really want you guys to de uh, defeat it battle 51 get that nice little title and stuff like that but um yeah that's it um, like comment subscribe it's me your boy Guru man and uh, enjoy the rest of the uh, the video peace.